chance to meet him on your people. So yeah, this is going to be really adventurous for me since it's my first time out of Nigeria. So let's see how this goes. Okay. It was finally time to land in Doha after so much sleeping. You can see my eyes like <laughs> I literally just woke up like an hour to land in. So yeah, I was I slept all through the journey. Flights are boarding 
in less than an hour and i don't know my gates jjc diaries i don't know my gates so i'm trying to locate my gates and my battery is dead but i'll try and show as much as possible as usual welcome to hamad international airport doha all right time for me to run long this airport is huge massive <laughs> youtuber will i be if i don't show you guys this teddy bear so now let me just show you guys around and run for my flights okay i'm late now time to go time to go all right bye kata time to go to paris <laughs> It was time to take off to Paris and something that I noticed about Qatar Airways is they will serve you and serve you like they serve twice for each flight like that was crazy I missed the second food because I was sleeping more the food is it's it's fair it's fair it's fair enough so I would definitely like recommend Qatar Airways anytime any day it was I enjoyed my flight was lovely. I'll do it over and over again. So yeah, it was lovely. idea where i'm supposed to do that but i guess i'll ask questions so yeah welcome to charles to go paris time to go get my bag
still i've been able to finally locate where i'm supposed to take the train i'm still trying to um, locate where exactly i'm supposed to wait for the train but yeah i'm taking the train to nantes because that's where i have accommodation for now i'm still processing my accommodation in paris and hopefully for the end of the week would have a place in Paris and we can move over the weekend. I'm saying we like people are coming with me. Oh it's our channel so yeah. <laughs> Anyways um yeah so hopefully I can move to my place in Paris by the end of the week. So I'm really looking forward to each other because I'd have gone to school today or tomorrow but because I'm going to stay in fire is difficult. No transport here is not <laughs> it's not like Nigeria you just be one thousand or two thousand to just move to another city or something. So um, yeah, so that's what I'm up to. That's what I'm up to right now. So I'll see you guys at the when I'm inside the train. I just, I'm just hoping I can pack my load, like see my load. I'm just hoping I can pack my load into the train, like that's my fear. So I had to, from upstairs, I had to, I was supposed to carry my bags downstairs to where the train is. Like you go down and go down. That's how it is from upstairs. But I just saw one African looking man and he was speaking French to me. And I was like, and I asked him, do you speak English? I was like, yeah, you're looking for the train, right? I said, yes. He was like, there's no need for me to use the escalator. I should just go into the uh, elevator and press number two. That's where I'm going to announce see my train. I was like, oh, wow. <laughs> and so he will help me carry my things. So my fear now is how I'm going to pack all these things into the train. Because the train is um, um, for two minutes. The boarding time for train is two minutes. My storage is almost full and I don't know if to get something to eat. So let's see what they have. What they call it on? Horizon. For the sake of getting one. And I want to try it and see if it's nice. My last one percent. 